five, four, five. <laughs> you done it right because you ended like that. Four, three. See, I told you it's not easy. <laughs> it is actually quite hard. I don't know why. It's weird. Two. Five, four, three, two, one. My name is Salim Qasim and I'm the co-founder and chief editor of The Muslim Vibe. So my role at The Muslim Vibe is essentially overseeing the team, so working with Hassan and Jessica in kind of social media and the written side of things. Um, and then every now and then I'm allowed to have a little bit of input on the video. They don't trust me much with that, so... Um... My name is Asib and I'm the creative director and co-founder of The Muslim Vibe. As the creative director, my job is to make sure that everything looks nice. Um, so that's the branding, the website, making sure the videos are of a certain standard. Am I saying deputy or senior? Can I be deputy? Can I just say editor? I'm Jessica and I'm the editor here at The Muslim Vibe. I edit all the articles that come in and I just keep in touch with all of our writers who come from literally all around the world. What do I do? My role entails producing, filming and editing uh, all of the video content that you see on The Muslim Vibe that ranges from the short news stories that you see uh, to some of the short uh, original documentaries that you see as well. I'm Aya, I'm a freelance graphic designer working for the Muslim Vibe. My name is Hassan Hadi and I am the social media manager here at TMV. So I host the podcast as well. One of the main things that I try to consciously be aware of every single day is empowering people. Um, whether it's through ideas or action, you know, that's kind of an individual thing, but I really think that's one of the main things that we try to do here. With the Muslim Vibe, the vision is to be a leading platform for young Muslims in the West, a kind of space to nurture and grow and really champion a Western Muslim identity, and to act as that space to facilitate that for young Muslims. The idea is that young people can feel like they, they have somewhere that they can go to, um, somewhere that they can learn, um, and feel that they're part of a wider community. That's something that we're working towards every single day here at TMV. Uh, I feel like that that's something that uh, we've somewhat um, built the foundations for uh, and inshallah in five years, uh, in 10, 20, 30 years beyond now, um, we'll see that uh, really uh, transform into something uh, really powerful inshallah. What I love working, what, what I love most, this idea. What I love about working at the Muslim Vibe the most is we create content that actually affects people's lives. More than anything really is seeing that the Muslim Vibe is a platform for everyone. It's really kind of uh, uplifting to see that the platform is, is, is being used. I think getting to speak to and meet loads of incredible people from around the world. Over the last five years we've, we've met and worked with and collaborated with loads of amazing individuals. Jessica, do you mind not typing? Yeah, I was halfway through. What I love most about the Muslim Vibe is knowing that I can come in every single day and learn something new from an article or from a writer. Um, I also have the freedom to basically write on whatever I'm interested in and explore topics um, that are really, really diverse. Whenever I uh, travel and I meet with Muslims from different parts of the world, I always find that the Muslims that are around me have always uh, heard of or, or actively follow uh, the Muslim vibe. We sometimes forget the real people that are actively engaging with that content. If we want help with each other, we can always in, like input into each other's ideas and give feedback and improve. It's like a small family we're working here together, so it's really good. Aww. Aww. One of my favourite moments of the Muslim Vibe was the first time our website crashed um, and it crashed because we had so many website visitors. It was just nice to see that we were getting so much traffic and traction um, and that's just continued to grow and grow. My best moment since joining the Muslim Vibe... Since Sorry, founding... Muslim Vibe. <laughs> my, my best moment at the Muslim Vibe has been um, when we hired our first full-time member of staff. Um, that was a time when we realised that okay, this is actually like quite serious. This is a nice feeling seeing the team grow, uh, being able to kind of help the team develop their skills, um, and taking content to the next level. And the Muslim vibe helped me to kind of um, embrace and have more confidence in my designs and um, have like a purpose. It's a place where really we come in uh, and uh, we're pushed to. Uh, create content not only that's important that, and, and that helps people but also content that we enjoy. My plans for the Muslim Vibe uh, for the next five years or more is giving you guys the opportunity to be a part of this platform for you guys to uh, have your voice on a platform such as this. In these few short years that we've been active 
Um, it's really been wonderful to see our team grow and expand. Uh, not just our team, but the work that we're doing itself go and expand and impact more and more people. Inshallah, my plans is to keep working for the Muslim vibe and keep spreading the good message. My goal is to get more and more writers on board. Right now we have hundreds of writers and they do come from all over the world, but I really hope to expand the Muslim vibe um, to all corners of the globe. This sounds like an empire. <laughs> my vision for the next five years of the Muslim vibe is really take this platform to the next level. Um, more professional, more content, more quality content. Really being at the cutting edge of what's out there in the media at the moment and providing a voice uh, to young Muslims around the world. In five years time it would be great to have just a, a bigger team and a bigger office um, and more people just creating fantastic content and being able to go out there and, and do amazing things in, in video and articles and podcasts and everything else and just you know we wanted to with the Muslim vibe create and facilitate a hub that people can I guess use and really make their own um, so that would be good if we can just see more people coming in and us creating more content and having more of an impact um, in the next five years that would be amazing